to ride through the bush like where's 22 I don't got a cap, put that on my hat I was in the trench, nigga, where was you? Yeah, nigga, rap, but I told strap They tryna get close, what I'm supposed to do? Be tight my killers don't catch you And I'm cool if they hit somebody close to you Let's get it she got her ass, she gon' shake it Since Holly Rome kicked a hole in the game Before multiple views by Tommy gone Gotta be strong when you're popping the paparazzi form Slider singing in your local precinct like Blood leaking out the cat form You said it's a release party? Cool, cause now the album's streaming on the platform <laughs> Timothy twice, James seen it in my palms The Lord is my shepherd I shot a nigga reading Psalms <laughs> It's nasty Yeah, that happened Ask Matthew, Mark, and Luke, I hit him with a jaw. No, no, no. No. You know what it is, man. Salute to the subscribers, that notification game, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Don't let none of that get too far ahead of you. You know who I be. Follow me on IG, Vada underscore Fly. Tell your mama I said hi. Shout out to my guy Showtime SP Scrap, all my partners over at Fox. Shout out to our other channel, Stop the Run. We've been dropping a lot of sports content on there. Just hit 500 subscribers, and we're gonna continue to drop content on there too, because it's a lot of things going on that we could talk about. But bruh. <laughs> Battle rap, like I said yesterday in the other blog, it's been kind of slow, not a lot of events going on, but, you know, there was one event, and I did get to peep one of the battles that I really wanted to see, you know what I'm saying, shout out to the platform, you know what I'm saying, um, Kansas City, Missouri, uh, shout out to Ruin Your Day, shout out to everybody who put this event together, um, they had A-Ward versus Gwitty, T-Top versus J that guy, Dot versus Bad News, and there was some other battles on there, and it was um, Gwitty versus A-Ward, you know what I'm saying? Pretty interesting battle. Uh, I, I see what Gwitty does. Gwitty is a guy who's been able to continually keep a name in battle rap, and whether it's him uh, with his ad-libs, or him with his promotion, or the IG lives, or his hip-hop is real interviews, Gwitty has always found a way to continue to keep himself immersed in battle rap, you know what I'm saying? He's a guy that's never really been on URL. Um, I will give him credit though, when he was on, when he was doing the RBE thing, he was one of the first people when RBE started to really pick up momentum in like 2021, 2022, he was really repping RBE hard. I'm talking about back when Sue Surf was out, you know what I'm saying? Now I know, and we could we could be honest, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to Gra, 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 Gra. Shout out to everybody out there. We could be honest. Um, there was a time when RBE, when URL was obviously the most prominent league out of everything, everything that was going on there, all of the big events. They had Sue Surf, and it was just all wins. Easy the Black Captain was doing his thing, then Easy left, you know what I'm saying? And then 2023 was what it was. But when RBE was not in the prone position as the number one league and they've been around for 10 years but they've consistently been like number two number two number two number three number two last year was the first year that they really cemented themselves in the top spot do i think that i don't know if it's going to happen again because i don't even know how interested arp is in doing events you know what i'm saying but back to gwitty um you know he was one of them guys that was really repping the brands kfc we got new biscuits uh swirl star it's nasty and all of this and when the bags and bodies was originally done, he had got eliminated. You know what I'm saying? But he wasn't even supposed to be on there. I mean, well, he was, people wanted him on there, then he wasn't on there, then the reaction to him not being on there, then somebody had wound up falling off the show for whatever reason personally, then Gwitty was winding up getting a spot. He was on season one, he was on season two, and he continues to make a name for himself, right? So he's battling against A Ward. I got on live with Gwitty last week, and I was like, dog, there's no way he beat A Ward. That's the nerve of you. <laughs> you That's disrespect. Like That's like, yo, you're gonna lose. You know what I'm saying? I, and he's doing this whole, he can't rap like me. I, everything that he said, I heard before. And I'm sitting there listening, like, yo, Gwitty, A War is gonna air fry you. Like, there's nothing. What the hell is you gonna do? What are you gonna do with A Ward? I was like, yo, there's just nothing. I had no doubt in my mind. He said, live in a house with 15 men for 30 days and battle for free? Hell, sign me up again! Bro, what? That did not happen. <laughs> that never happened. I ain't gonna lie, I'm getting cooked. <laughs> <laughs> Same thing. <laughs> I said, if you watch the show, you know Hitman was the greatest of bosses. Yeah, yeah. Come in a couple times a week with a challenge where they can make him a profit. One night, they played hide and seek. Gwitty won. He hid away for the longest. They finally found him the next day in J2 room, and then he came oh! out the closet. He got away with it.
but he ain't get away with it. They finally found him the next day. Oh my God. Yeah. Yeah. Now they all yeah. 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 That never happened. That A War was not only going to take the battle, he was going to uh, be serious and he was going to cook you all three rounds, and that did happen. A Ward went ballistic on you. Now, Gwitty does this thing where he's like, nah, nah, nah. Like, he reverses. I hear what he be doing, you know what I'm saying? Like, he'll be like, Burglarize in the casino and look at me now. I'm making chips flip. I can mix it. So my pants for cake like Bisquick. You a Christian. Bitch, the finger pointing. Found uh, Speed past the easy pass. Bullets took a toll. Then he'll be, then he'll be like, nah, nah, nah. Nah, nah. I'm still on the road. Rumor has it, bullets hit his side, his heart took a toll. Like, he just starts, like, and I get it, you know what I'm saying? It's a way that he raps, and he has people that enjoy what he does, but in a battle versus A Ward, dog, you ain't getting no round. You ain't getting no round. Like, the first round, A Ward clear. Second round, A Ward clear, and he was doing a lot of freestyling. Third round, A Ward clear, clear, clear. He, st <laughs> he started talking, he said, <laughs> it, I just remember, like, certain bars that he just was bombing away. He said, I got something you don't got, and that's a washing machine. Crazy. Um, and then, <laughs> like, he was talking about what's nasty, uh, told, you know what I'm saying, calling your shit the album and you ain't dropped one. Then he had the bar about uh, the, the hit, uh, hit the leak the album and have it leaking on the stream and all type of shit. Like, he was wilding on you. Woody had some funny joints. He had the one Bible scheme that was pretty funny. But he was like, I shot him shooting Psalms. And then dude was like, that really happened. I say, yo, this shit is so funny. Cause how this dude that's standing right there. In my palms, the Lord is my shepherd. I shot a nigga reading Psalms. <laughs> it's nasty. Yeah, that happened. Somebody told a lie one day. Ask Matthew, Mark, and Luke, I hit him with a jaw. No, no, no. No, no, no. <laughs> the nigga said, that really happened. I'm like, yo, what is he? <laughs> and then the next line was, I hit him with a jaw. Like, it was funny, but when you put the, uh, when you put everything in the perspective, with you ain't win no rounds. Ain't no damn way. Ain't no way. And this is a $50 pay-per-view, man. So, you know, niggas really support what, what, what people got going on. And I love what A-Ward does. I spoke to A-Ward when A-Ward was um, at the trenches joint. We spoke on the live stream. And he was telling me about the importance of the battles that he has and how he helps put on for other leagues. And now I, I, I see what you mean, you know what I mean? Because a card like this doesn't really sell unless you're on it battling at a high level and really bringing your A-game. And you did that, you know what I'm saying? So for that, I, I, you know what I'm saying? I, I, I give you a shout out and a round of applause and that was a, um, that was a clean, 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 clean smoking. Man, he, he took all three. I, I, I don't think I got, I don't got Gwitty with no round. <laughs> I don't even know what you was rapping about, my nigga. Like I was truly, I was like, what is this nigga talking about? Man, like nigga, what made you the nigga to jump out the window and just get the I'm so flabbergasted, bro. <laughs> I am flabber I am flabbergasted, bro. I'm flabbergasted, bro. Oh god, I'm so confused, bro. These niggas got me fucked up. Like I just I don't know. Like did you think who heard it? Now I want to know who heard it. Who heard Gwitty shit before he went up there on that stage because. The way A Ward was talking to him was uncivilized. You know what I'm saying? And I like um, what A Ward's able to do. Uh, to see him back in 2024, you know, and, and I'm gonna do it like this, right? In 2023, A Ward had some battles that I personally felt like he lost. You know what I'm saying? And you know, that's not just me. I felt like he didn't win the frack one. I felt like he didn't win versus Big K, and I felt like he didn't win versus Real Sick either. That's three. You know what I mean? So. Um, coming into this year right here, he's got to be battling on a high clip trying to win every single battle and not taking as many, you know what I mean? Like, I think the higher you go in stature, and I know Edward's going to watch this because he cares about his career and the direction that he's going in. I got to get you on Fox this year too, so hit me up when you see this, you know what I'm saying? Shoot me a message and we got to talk about when I can bring you up because I, I, I love what you've been doing for Battle Rap. 
But I got to keep it, you know what I'm saying? I to keep it a buck. I got to be honest, you know what I'm saying? Hate that we spit and don't get the coach cut. This ain't Adrian Griffin. But uh, I, I, I think with you, you got to take the right battles because if you don't take a battle that's really going to drive you or, or have you in a, in a really, really crazy bag, you can get caught in situations where you're in a frack battle. Like, frack don't lose battles. I've been said this shit a million times. Frack don't lose battles. If you got an opportunity to battle frack or battle somebody else on the car, just take somebody else. Like, I'm good, you know what I'm saying? Like, some people that's just they're just too good, you know what I mean? Like, it is what it is. I don't see him lose enough for me to, I don't see him lose enough for me to feel comfortable battling him. Give me somebody that, <laughs> give me somebody that loses shit, you know what I'm saying? I take a nigga that lose some battles, you know what I'm saying? I don't want nobody that never loses, I gotta say. Be up all night writing for this motherfucker. He never lose. You know what I'm saying? So, um, shout out to him. But it took Big K. Big K was in the bag against you. A word don't really do good against white people anyway. I, it's, that's just, it, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? You're running out of names. You, you, all the ones that you got, you might got a, you got you, you might have a sub 500 record. I'm just saying. I know it was uh, let me think, damn. You know, Ill Mac got you, big Ill Mac got you, big K got you, then Mad Flex got you. Battle shoot. No, is that wrong? Is that wrong? Is that wrong? I don't know. Uh, Big K got you. Mad Flex got you. Ill Mac got you. It was. It's been. It's been. I, I'm still. I'm more than four. Is that my? I, you know what I'm saying? Oh, let me. You know what I mean? All right. Oh, and wasn't it my man? Um. What's my man name? Oh shit. Real deal. Five. Boom. Boom. I'm at five. I'm alive at five. I knew it, man. My mind. My mind. My mind working today. But uh. Yeah, so I, I just think that that uh, you know, but but overall, he was a phenomenal talent. I love what he does with his career. You know what I'm saying? He's been taking it in his own hands since the beginning. You know what I mean? I remember way back, and now he's in talks. I've been hearing rumors, been hearing rumors that he might be taking his his career, his talent to the next level. You know what I'm saying? We might possibly see. A war battle on URL in 2024. I think that's something that could help complete his legacy. I don't think he should come in battling against. No new niggas, you know what I'm saying? No new, new guys, the niggas that pee pushing. And not, I'm sorry, no, 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 not there either. And not the level above them either. The the dudes that's just barely on, you know, because he beat a lot of, he battled, he beat a lot of them already. He already battled Luke Castro, he already battled Ryder, he battled mad at them niggas before, you know what I'm saying? So I don't think he should be there either. I think the next little, next little level above that, you know what I'm saying? I think that's a good starting point for him if he's in there. But I got A-Ward winning the battle 3 0. 3 0, no hero. Quitty, I don't know what. <laughs> and you jumped on my live stream and told me that you was going 3-0 award. And I knew then it wasn't going to happen. I was like, bro, you bugging. I, I, like, man, I just let, I let you get your, I let you get your bars off because I'm going to come on this camera and I'm going to talk, talk my shit later. You know what I'm saying? It's greater later. And you're not here to tell me what happened, but I watched it. I only watched it one time. I don't have to watch it three times. I only watched it once. And I know you was like, oh, I don't care if I'm not getting no reaction and things like that. And you live for reaction, though. So how can a battle rapper that lives for reaction not care when they not getting reaction? Another thing is when you say you don't care that you're not getting reaction, you care because it's making you say that. You know what I'm saying? So you can't reverse psychology to shit. You wasn't getting no reaction. It was a couple bars that was funny. But for the most part, everything that you did that was even remotely close to being cool, A-Ward had shit that was like 10 times. <laughs> yeah. Y'all want to know what happened? Quit, you the first one of the year. Do y'all want to know what happened? I'm going to tell you what happened. He got smoked. That boy got smoked. Oh, my goodness, Gwitty. You got air fried. Like, you you, you is you is rotisserie. You are chipotle. You are, <laughs> you are bourbon glaze. You are black and seasoned. You got fried. Like, you are a sizzling fajita plate from, <laughs> from Chili's. When the waitress brings it to the table, she says, this might be it. This, this is hot. <laughs> they leave the glove with the... <laughs> My nigga, Gwitty got air fried, bro. You went all the way to Kansas City to do that, bro? Ain't no way. Oh, man. Good. It was styled on you, man. Ah, man. But shout out to you. Uh, you know, I ain't no hate. I fuck with what you do. I rock with your movement. But this one was just not it. No, no. And then you told me you was gonna win, so I had to. I had to recap it. Um, shout out to the platform. You know what I'm saying for putting in against the one person who could beat anybody. This is gonna be crazy. I think this is all gonna come down to uh, who does better at stopping the run. You know what I'm saying because 
with Patrick Mahomes, the, the the best way to even combat what he's able to do is to keep him off the field. You know what I'm saying? The longer he has the ball, the longer he can make plays. And especially if the game is close in the fourth quarter and it gets to four down territory, he's one of the hardest people to get off the field in four down territory. So, um, but I do have faith in the Baltimore Ravens. Uh, they're, they're like a storybook year. Odell Beckham is playing. Um, you know what I'm saying? Odell Beckham just has to be out there. He has to be respected. He has to be respected at least. You got to respect what he does. Whether you think he's going to burn you or not, he can still catch the ball. So he's going to require defenders. Zay Flowers has to be double teamed. You got Gus. And they got a lot of folks on the Baltimore side of the ball. I got Baltimore winning uh, pretty – I got them winning a close game, 31-28. As far as uh, Detroit and San Francisco, I'm actually rolling with Detroit, man. Like, I'm just saying, man. I got Detroit with the upset. Debo Sam was coming off an injury. Uh, the 49ers did decent versus Green Bay, but they lost, like, the whole game until the end. And Brock Purdy had a series that was better than Green Bay. You're not going to be able to do that versus Detroit. Detroit got a lot of weapons. I love what Amin Ross St. Brown is able to do. The, the Gibbs, the backfield, the running backs. My God. Yo, you're going to have to... They're going to have their hands full with the the Lions. The Lions are not going to be an easy out. Um, so I, I, I'm i just saying, I'm going with the Lions 27-24. You know what I'm saying? I might be wrong. It is what it is. But uh, other than that, man, salute to every single one of y'all that rock with this content, that watch us. You know what I'm saying? As more battle, y'all know. When the battle rap starts rolling and things start hitting, we will be talking about it, you know what I'm saying? But it's been good to get a couple weeks off to get a break. I don't just come up here and just blog for no reason, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm never, I don't ever want to get to a point where it's like, I got to just jump on camera and talk because I got to hit a certain quota for the month and shit. Trust me, I enjoy all of the breaks and times that I get, you know what I'm saying? So, I don't be tripping. But hope to see y'all soon. You already know what it is, man. And I'm um, subscribed to the channel if you like what's going on here. Subscribe to our other channel, Stop the Run. It's your boy Vada Fly. Tell your mama I say hi. Oh, shout out to my brother Riggs. You know what I'm saying? He uh, sent me the hoodie, you know what I'm saying? He got his merch going and all of that, you know what I'm saying? Got a shout out to him, you know what I'm saying? I threw it on with the old... Uh, KD All-Star joints, the, the 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 joints that kind of orange and joint, they match this too, you know what I'm saying? We got a good little fit together today. But it is what it is, man. Shout out to every single one of y'all. Don't get a gun involved. Grah, grah, gang.